rainbow. Well, let's walk around Pattaya. Of course, everybody knows this intersection. We're gonna see a bunch of different areas in Pattaya and talk about them, see what it's like in November, 2021. I've never seen this intersection this empty. This is, especially in the daylight, this is very interesting. So a unique situation. Well, definitely uh, tree town was an experience I mean I can't wait to come back later tonight and check that out and see what it's like when it's all lit up but it looks like they've done a great job just kind of building it up and now I'm gonna walk through soy made in Thailand it's my understanding that it's going to be shutting down and I just wanted to see if there's a couple establishments that I know there that are gonna be going away or not uh, so we'll go check that out real quick Well, this is one of the places I wanted to check on, uh, the sexy bar behind me. And I remember going here before. Uh, I came in just behind uh, Cheap Charlie and I missed him about two years ago. I missed him by a few minutes here. And ever since then, it's just been kind of like uh, a place that I like to come when I'm in town, but it looks like it's all closed down. It's probably not gonna reopen. Much of this area, it looks like it's getting knocked down. And so, yeah, that's, that's about it as far as checking out if the sexy bar was still around. Well, the uh, Pattaya Bazaar, which is a nice building that has kind of like all your luggage and clothing and all your tennis shoes and stuff like that. Um, it's open for business. Um, I looked inside. There were most of the shops were open. Uh, stocked, as you can see behind me, the stock was stuff to buy. I also walked down Soy Honey, open for business. So pretty much all the establishments were open, uh, maybe at you know 50% capacity for daytime, usual daytime, but uh, Soy Honey is open. And I'm gonna continue walking down the second road now. Uh, and I'm gonna probably end up over on the beach as well, just kind of see what it looks like. 
just, you know, just leveled this whole area. Just absolutely leveled. I'm pretty sure this was, at one time, soy made in Thailand. And it's just rubble. Wow. That, that, that's really something. Just had to get a quick video of this. It's like a robot that's going around the uh, Central Festival. Looks like it's delivering flowers. Just thought that was kind of cool. It's like a service robot. But the real reason why I came in here is because every time I go to Pattaya, I gotta have one of these right here. This has uh, walnuts and like a little bit of, like a touch of cream cheese in it. And then these ones right here that have uh, the red bean in it and the taro, they're both delicious. Um, this red bean one, as like every time I come to Pattaya, I always have to get this. I get it pretty much every morning. I'm here a little bit later than morning, but this is like a must get. And they used to have a different shape one as well. Looks like this is what they're making right now. But that one as well, I'm gonna tell you, fantastic. Look at all these, oh, look at how delicious everything looks. Oh man. All right, so we're in Central Festival. As you can see, the, the food shops are open and uh, the supermarket behind me where I got my uh, red bean bun right here, uh, it's open. Not many people walking around in here, it's pretty quiet. But just trying to do like a daytime update of Pattaya. I'm gonna go down to the water, take a look at the beach area. And uh, then I'm gonna start heading down a little bit further. We're gonna see what uh, Soy 6 looks like. I'll walk through Soy 6 and uh, maybe take second road back. Yep, well, it does look like something is going to happen down here tomorrow night. Uh, big outdoor music right on the beach. Some kind of a, I see they got a big screen set up. So it looks like it's going to be some kind of a festival going on. And right over here, you'll see, looks like a screen back there tucked in there. So uh, this should be fun. Check this out tomorrow night. Well, unlike soy honey that was open for business, I don't see anything open for business on uh, Soy 6 at all. It's completely shut down. There's nothing open. That's just the way it is. Tree Town at night is beautiful. I wanted to show you these shots. They're very careful. They don't want any filming inside Tree Town. So I just got some outdoor shots so you can see the lights. It's, it's really nice.